All right, Poxy Foxy, get over here. Sunny and fair, I come again. The famous husband and wife variety act are in town as we speak. They're playing at Nero's Palazzo, and it's sold out. Oversold, in fact. Yeah, because half the ticket holders would be too drunk to show up anyway. God, I love this town. So, how did the hot... The Molinaries hired the couple to draw new customers to replace the ones you drove away from their casino. What if the show were cancelled? They'd all want a refund, and the Molinaries would take it right in the assets. So. And how would you suggest I go about breaking up their little show? Fry them on stage? Nothing quite so drastic, my high-level violent no, I have a more entertaining idea. Yeah, I say we take two corn muffins, a live badger, a teaspoon of flesh-eating bacteria, and... Uh, uh, I suppose you just want me to talk to them. So. The word around town is that Fair has been making goo-goo eyes. At a certain southern rock and roll personality by the name of Leg Tallman. Perhaps a touch of marital trouble. Tell me what do you say, Grito? Ready for a little marriage counseling? So we gotta fuck up their marriage? All right, Pox. I'll go snatch the singing hick and bust up the lovebirds. Yeah, just let me slip into something a little more comfortable. Sup? All right, all right, all right. I get it, I get it. I've done this for two games already. Sammy and Find Fair. Fair's not-so-secret boyfriend, Leg Tolman, and Sammy and Fair's marriage and TV show will be finished. A fat woman. I sure... No audio, great. <laughs> See, there they are, that's the artifact I was talking about. Floating in there the air. it is! Now, make those fabulous blonde locks your own. Ah. Snatch him! Sweet Matilda. Uh, that'd make a crap or something. <laughs> I Thumbs think up. I'm drunk. So, yes, yes, physical maybe. sensations don't rub it in. Sleep it off later. Just get to the Sammy and Fair show. Looky here. You're like a fucking diaper you on. You just Tum. start by funny guy. Mm. Hurry, Crypto. You need to get legs all in to Nero's Palazzo before the show starts. Ah! I think I'm too late. It's about to start any second. Free your mind of distractions, Crypto. That voice, it's, it's in my head. What voice? Concentrate on expanding your mind. Huh. Yes. That voice. Hippies, they make your eyes move. Are you really hearing voices or are you angling for a section eight like that cross-dressing fellow on you know, Klinger, who in the later episodes wasn't in drag anymore because Radar left. Some sort of TV reference. Meditate with me, Crypto. Meditate? It means doing this. <laughs> Hell yeah. Time stop is a powerful ability that lets Crypto briefly pause time. Press B. Crypto, why are you wasting time? The show is mostly...
moments away from starting. Huh? Hey, man, I heard that hot bait fair is performing tonight. Yeah, she sure is, but Sammy warned me to keep you out, sir. No way, dude. Why you gotta be so down on a rambling man? Because the last time I let somebody suspicious in, the whole casino got wrecked. Man, you don't know who you're messing with. Uh, uh, me and the Molinari bros are old buddies. Please, you wouldn't know a Suprasata from a cup of gold. Listen, man, I'm just Cupid's errand boy here. I gotta see fair. It's about love. All right, fine, go in. But when you get thrown out head first, don't come crying to me. Tuh. At least he let me in. At least he let me in. There they are! Send them into counseling! Ugh. We've got each other, hun. Thank you! These are the most fucked up All things right. I've seen in my life. Jehoshaphat, uh, that's entertainment, yeehaw! Look at the nerd next Ladies to me with the camera. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> the original Midnight Rider, Blake Tallman! Come on up, Blake. It's like a game show. There's a random woman I'd walking around the stage. I'd like to give him a leg up. Woo! <laughs> and like, we're always up for a little showbiz repartee, but what are you trying to do, break up my act? <laughs> You calling me a chicken stealer meatball? Who are those people behind? They're all fucked up. <laughs> Let you go hey, see. man, learn to roll with the jokes. No, sir. It's just my boyish southern charm. I can't help it. Well, that's a relief. For a second, I thought you were trying to steal my girl. Gypsies, tramps, and thieves couldn't keep me away. He was born a rambling man. Woo! Well, that'd be just my kind of luck. <laughs> I always did have a hard time with women. Says laundry habits. What are you talking about? You got too many women. I'm gonna take one off your hands. Hey, look, it's his oh, brother. Lord, take it's his, me it's away. his clone. That fucking fat guy with the camera, his clone was walking right you there. You know, not a lot of guys who look like me could get a fabulous diva like Fair. Cool not without a safety deposit box full of nasty film negatives. You can't prove that. I say, I mean, a goddess hanging out with a big nose twerp like you, she should get the best actress award. Woohoo! Woohoo. That's it, man. I'm going into politics. Because I'm a solo act. Relax, babe. The beat goes on. So I broke them up, I guess. <laughs> According to the game, I broke them up. <laughs> this is a silly game. Graphics suck more than the second one, but I mean the story's okay. I don't know. Oh well, the game is the destruction's kind of fun once you get over it. You know, if it weren't for us, I bet they would have gone on forever. Crypto, meet me at the space dust. I have made an important discovery. Really? Oh, whatever could it be? Well, I'm not screwing around. Just gonna go do my mission. Hey, look, there's two boxes. It's one over there and one over here. Holy shit! And the saucer comes down and flips all the cars over. Look at that, all the DNA. I didn't know when people died, their brains just flipped out of their heads. All right, Poxmart. Resistance. 
bigger jetpack. Alright, what the hell did Tox find out? So we're gonna find out.